As a resident that's been here almost 20 years now, I just love the fact that we can listen to birdsong like we can right now, go for a hit of golf over the corner here, but then still have the luxuries of an espresso martini or a champagne or a beautiful lunch after we've had that, that walk. And, and you? Yeah, well, as you know, Christine, for the first 10 years that um, we lived up here, we lived literally on the other side of this gully. So I just don't think there's a more spectacular place that you can live than right here. Not only that, I saw my first koala in that tree over there when I first moved up here, when I was walking Jack when he was a puppy. This used to be our walking track from our house all the way round along here, and there was a koala just sitting down there. I just couldn't believe what I'd seen. Yeah, it's a pretty magical place. Oh, eh? it really is. The house is like this um, majestic space that sits on a hill and you come up the driveway and walk through the door and there's this lovely landing which has a, a nook that can be used for any multiple purposes with two bedrooms, a bathroom and the landing which actually has a separate entry as well which is delightful. You go up the next level and then you've got this space here. How magical it is to walk through and just everywhere you see is trees. Yeah. It's like um, a tree house in a way, but way more elegant and luxurious with its fit out. The kitchen I love, any master chef would enjoy uh, the space and the oven and everything um, in which to spoil those that have come for a visit. As you know, anybody uh, that buys up here has lots of visitors. I couldn't agree more. I just think this house is absolutely fabulous. In fact, I actually watched it being built from across the other side of the road and uh, we've uh, seen the bones of the garden go in and then once the uh, current owners came in here, the amount of work that they've done since they've been here with the tearing of the back, beautiful landscaping that they've had done really has just added to the property. The lovely thing about it is all the textural changes in the trees, the colours, everything about it. There's really, there's just nothing that I don't like about this property. It's got something for everybody. And as you said, just having those bifold doors, bringing the outside in or the inside out, whichever way you want to look at it, you'd be pretty damn lucky to be living here or using it as a weekend, a part-timer, whatever you choose to do with it. The other great thing, of course, is that here we've got all these spaces where we can sit outside but still be connected to inside and what's going on with everybody. And then of course sitting out underneath that glorious tree down there is an outdoor area which I just think would be beautiful at about four or five o'clock in the afternoon and you're having a glass of wine or a cup of coffee and, um, and the world is just going by you. The room that in a way I love most is the master bedroom. I, I could really imagine someone sitting there with their laptop, their books, their wine or coffee, tea, whatever it is, you pull back the doors and the birds are there, the trees are there and uh, it's a, really a sanctuary with a marvellous master ensuite which is very impressive. And for anyone that is looking for the perfect place that you can work from home or even run your business from the, the lower ground area, I thought that could be a consultancy room or something like that. But uh, who wouldn't want to be here and work from here, whether it's under the tree or out in the, um, the tiered area at the back there. If homework life balance is the buzzword of today, this property has got it in spades. What we mustn't forget is that the golf course is literally just up behind us. So I reckon you could just about drop a gate into the back and I'm not quite sure what that tee is, but uh, you know, you're well and truly into hitting some balls before you know it. And uh, it's so close to the village, which I just absolutely adore. And uh, you can go into the general store and you can buy just about anything you want to, including some beautiful regional wine. You've got a Palais down the road. Um, you've got Peppers, you've got um, the Surly Goat, you've got Frank and Connie's, Har Harry's Eatery. You know, the list just goes on of all the fabulous things that um, Hepburn and Hepburn Springs have got to offer. So we've had crazy times and uh, this home and the village that we're in really nurtures the heart. I think this will serve anybody that wants a sanctuary for themselves and those they love. Annette, how lucky are we to be sitting in a space like this, in a village like this, right in the heart of the spa country.